I'm about to show you a creation the likes of which you've never seen before. The sizing of this creation might be off a little bit, but you should still be very terrified. This is the ancient jaw titan and as you can see it's not quite the same size as i would think it should be but it's you know it's not as big as some of the other ones but it still looks very menacing and extremely terrifying let's see what happens oh it just <laughs> straight up like chop blocked him with the big giant spike hands as he tries to, is he trying to eat them he's totally trying to eat them but the question is can he get one of them get him in there yeah he's really trying use that jaw of yours oh he's just crushing these guys look at it just crushing that dude i was gonna say you know what not a lot of them are actually dying but then you know you got a guy like this and you can clearly see the pain that was inflicted on this poor soul Oh no, oh no, he's a big gruesome monster. Well, uh, that, that's, I guess that's what happens when you actually have a crocodile head hidden hiding underneath your skin. I don't think he actually ate anybody though. He just kind of crushed them. He didn't eat a single one of them. Before we get any further into today's video, Hippo. Hippo on a rock. Look at him. Isn't he majestic in all his blubbery goodness? Anyway, they say subscribe to the channel because only like 12% of you guys are subscribed. And if you do, you get to see things like this. This here is our friend Hippopotamus that's been evolved to a max level, but he's grown even more since the last time we last saw him. He now has even bigger big flappy things up here, as well as more spikes, and he's way more terrifying than he once was before. I'm pretty sure though, he'll still in- Oh! Just straight up crushed that one! Oh, look at him flinging him around! Okay, this is even worse than it was, like, this is even more powerful than it was last time. I don't know what happened, but clearly this thing has reached a new level. Oh, any creation that could just fling hippos around like it's nothing is one to be recommended. Look at it, look at him! He's, he's just pincering him and putting him up on his mouth to save for later. I'm a fan of this thing. They are some of my favorite creations I've seen lately, simply because I like all the specky speckies. And they don't have a tail. They just kind of have a spiky butt, and that's it. Spiky butts are dangerous. I'm not sure what it does, and if it does anything, but it definitely looks cool. This is a cargo truck. Look at that! I think we're supposed to put things back here. Aren't, don't you think so? And also, do those spin? I think those are supposed to spin. But, oh, there they go. They're kind of working. What's happening? Okay, it's driving away. I think we're supposed to put things in the back of that thing. Yeah, it's a whole cargo truck full of these guys. Will it actually drive? It's driving. They're staying in there. They can't get out. Yeah! <laughs> Fleeing around. Take that, ants! You're about to get destroyed by these dudes in the back with shotguns, although half of them fell over because they couldn't handle the G-force on that insane whip around. Might as well be launching in a spaceship. They're not very effective at the job. You probably need that missile, dude. Something tells me you only need one guy in there. Can you start driving? There he goes. He's getting his missiles ready. There we go. Oh, did he just destroy himself? He might have just destroyed himself. He just destroyed himself. He literally pushed himself into the bottom of the car. Well, uh, turns out that that guy wasn't nearly as good because he got all derped out and then he died. Oh, it's so tiny. It's a lot smaller than I thought it was. Look at this motorcycle. Isn't that awesome? There's a guy on here. He's laying down having a good time. He looks like he's about to go. He's about to go for a ride. He's got jet boosters, but it's so small. I thought it was going to be huge, but it's like a little tiny thing. Whoa, it's super fast. Look at him. Look at him go. He's spiking stuff. Maybe we need to. Oh, he's got flamethrowers. This dude's chaotic. Oh, he died. He's a little chaos beast. We need to put something else in. Pigs ought to do it, right? Pigs. Yeah, spike that pig right in the right in the noggin. Oh, there he goes. He's he's all over the place. I can barely keep track of him because he's so fast and spinny. His little spikes are doing something, and he's got a flamethrower. It's kind of weird why he doesn't actually use it all the time, though. Oh, did he win? Yay! He won. He got all the pigs. Good job, dude. You biker from the future. Here's our good friend Hog Rider, and here's a big gigantic Geigen. Geigen, I said it right this time, okay? And clearly he has lasers coming out of his eyeballs, so that's a whole new thing even of itself, but I really was hoping we'd watch him just, oh yes, look at this. Usually the big spike doesn't work too well, but he put little spikes all over it. So now they're spiking the little Hog Rider guys, flinging them up in the air. 
Oh, that is brutal. We need something. They're all dead already? Oh, wow. You're more powerful than I thought. Let's see what he can do to a bunch of these things. Can he spike and fling them just as well as the other thing? Oh, 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 he can fling. Oh, there he goes. He's spiking them, flinging them up. Get them, lift them up. Hoop in the air. Pick them up. They're all dead already. They keep dying so fast. Not only that, because they keep dying because of these spikes on his belly, but also the laser eyes. I really want to see him just spike more things. Maybe we need to get rid of the lasers for a second and just watch him spike some stuff. Where are those lasers? Hello. Little lasers hiding in your eyeballs. Need to get rid of them real fast. Oh, there's a big one. There we go. I think these all gone. Now he's just got little flaming eyes. That's all right. Now we can watch him spike. He just spiked like three guys at once. Pick him up. Fling him in the air. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Look at him go. He's got him on his spikes and he's picking up a whole bunch at once. This thing's awesome. This is like what Bowser should have been. I mean, let's be real. He got beat by Mario and he was in like a super advanced technological teacup. <laughs> Dropping bombs on top. You know what I like, gorillas? I like a game called Tabs. I also like a game called Arbs. And when you put Tabs and Arbs together, you get this. It's an ice giant. Look at him. is not he look so cool? He also has laser powers that are shooting out of his mouth. He looks really good. He looks just like an ice giant. That's so cool. Watch him as he bashes and destroys these little tiny gorillas into doom and oblivion. He needs a uh, ice breath though. I guess that's kind of what the laser is supposed to be, huh? But he needs like ice coming out of there, like ice little flames or whatever. And all he does is kind of spin around and punch them, okay? He seems, he seems good. Well, he destroyed all of them. He is, he's quite powerful. What is he, a Goro? I think he's a Goro. Maybe he's just a big gorilla. Are you a big gorilla? Nope, I think that was a, a person head. So it's like he's got gorilla arms. He acts like Goro, but he's not Goro. He's half, this is what it is the whole time. Ice giant had skin on half, he's half man, half gorilla. Now the moment you've all been waiting for, as promised, a creation that, you know what? Every time I say, oh, I've seen everything. And then someone makes a new feature or a new creation that's like, wow, haven't seen that yet. That's pretty awesome. This thing is called the Helicorpion Shark Jira. And in a second, you'll see why. But behold the features of this Colossus Beast, and then look as whatever is on his arms and hands. I think they're supposed to be like fins? They're big, gigantic things. And then we move into one of the most epic looking faces I think I've ever seen. Look at this mouth, and then this thing. I freaking love this i think it's probably because it reminds me of like a kraken like an octopus a big tentacle coming from his face stinking thing is awesome but let's watch what kind of abilities does he have. he's got lasers i can see the lasers and he's got big spikes so clearly he's gonna spike some stuff now when you first see this crash you might be like that looks like something i've seen before from somebody oh look at his tongues flailing around that's so cool like his tongue's moving this is actually by venom shark kid which he he makes some pretty awesome gigantic creations and he's an, and he he's there's like th whoa look at his tail too oh his tail's got a laser there's like three people who make like some of the most amazing things unirite magna and this venom shark kid and as you can see uh his uh, tail is doing all the work over here it's pretty epic he can't get up help someone call life alert other than the occasional falling over you can see that he's a gigantic beast that's not to be messed with. But I actually am curious to know how you do against some other large things. But he definitely, uh, he's got a balance issue. But overall, I mean, he is standing up for the most part pretty well. He's doing quite well for a big large beast. Usually the bigger they are, the weirder they get. His tail just tried to eat something. Sweet. And then he's got his big spikes. Oh, the body slam. And then this laser through the gigantic beast it's all over i think here we go guys thank you so much for stopping by and watching today's video let me know what you think of this thing this is a cool creation i really like this thing it's uh unique it's got some cool features and yeah it is what i like big gigantic epic things anyway thanks for watching click one of the two videos you're about to see i hope you're having a great day subscribe like all the good stuff consider becoming a member support the channel that way i'll see you guys next time